welcome back to Catharsis Inc. So today I have a Target haul for you all and this will be all items from the Bullseye Playground or as I call it Target's Dollar Spot. So without further ado let's hop right in. So I've noticed in the Dollar Spot that they've started doing little signs and trinkets that would be perfect for tear trays so I picked up this cute little one that says homemade apple cider instead of a hot chocolate bar this year for fall I definitely want to do an apple cider bar I thought that would be perfect for fall I also picked up this cute little one it says eat together live thankfully gather often so cute and they have tons of different options so definitely check out your target for those i also picked up these bag of pumpkins oh and i also wanted to tell you those little signs were a dollar each and then this bag is three dollars and it comes with six pumpkins thought they were really cute I also picked up this, what are they calling it? A wood crate. So this is what it's gonna look like when I put it together. And this is $5. I thought this would be really cute to put pumpkins in or apples in. And then you could also do some foliage in there as well. I think that would look really pretty. Then they also came out with some of these what are they called? It's some type of, oh, it's a bushel basket. And this was $5. I thought these were really good idea for DIY project because you could paint it or stain it to match your aesthetic. And then of course you can fill it with apples or pumpkins or um, even a mum if you wanted to. So picked one of those up. Then I also found this beautiful amber colored jar and this was five dollars as well and it comes with the leather strap and handle i thought that would be perfect for fall absolutely love that color so pretty and then oh i found this cute little it's kind of like sweater material or maybe just like a fuzzy blanket material super cute and this was a dollar. And then I also found some Halloween items. So Target again this year came out with the cute little keychains. And this one's a little frog with a witch's hat. I thought that was so adorable. And this one was two dollars. And they also have other characters as well. Super cute. And then they came out with these really cute brooms. Now they have one in this natural color and then they also came out with a black as well. And this was $5. So I picked that up. And these you could actually spray with essential oil or a room spray. So it soaks up that scent and then it could be like those pumpkin spice brooms or cinnamon brooms that you find in the store. Then I also found this cute little shelf house. It is so cool. So this was $5 as well. And it actually has an anchor on the back so if you wanted to hang it up. Or, of course, you could just put it on some type of tabletop. But, so cute. Love that. Then I also found this cloche. I thought this would be so cool with a Halloween scene in there. So you could do some sort of skull and moss. Or if you're into beetles, I think that would be really cool as well. And this one was $5 as well. Then next up I found this tray and it has snakes for handles. I thought that was super cool. So I picked that up. This was $5. So my favorite Harry Potter character is Severus Snape. 
hence my one of my dogs his name is Severus so I have like a whole setup of Severus Snape items that I display on my bookshelves so I thought this tray would be perfect to add to that setup so that's what I picked that up for and then the last item I found was actually on my wish list and it's this little door I absolutely love it I was wondering what did they call it novelty stand door but I if if you've seen my other videos you'll know that I set up different fairy garden gnome scenes throughout the year for the different holidays and stuff so I thought this would be perfect to add to my collection as like a fairy door or gnome door I just think it is so cute love that I know this was a smaller haul, but it was really good item, so I hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, definitely give this video a like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Thanks, guys. Bye.